What is up guys, it's AVX, bringing you guys another Call of Duty challenge, and this is the one point challenge, I'm just giving it a random name, I like giving them names, and shout out to Simon for coming up with this, he left a comment saying to do this challenge, and the challenge is to get a nuclear with a class where you only use one perk, and... I mean, you only use scavenger, and you can use one gun. No attachments, no perks, besides scavenger, no C4, nothing like that. And I actually will go on a 25 gun streak in this gameplay. I don't get the nuclear, but I still thought it was pretty good because it was my first try getting it. So, you know, it wasn't like me grinding for hours trying to get this challenge. It was my first try, and in my opinion, it's pretty good for a first try. And... You know, it's pretty entertaining in my opinion, you know, because I'm using such a bad class and I still drop a bunch of VSATs in one life. And I think that's really entertaining. So, anyways guys, I've been playing a lot of League play lately and I played with uh, my friend Divine Noob. He invited me from YouTube onto his uh, team and, you know, he invited me to try out and they were really good. And, you know, it's really fun when you have people on League Play who are really skilled or at least the same level as you because, you know, usually when I play League Play before, I play it with, you know, I play it with, you know, friends who, they just feel like playing League Play, they're in the mood, they never really play, and, you know, I'm not trying to seem cocky because, you know, I do play a lot, I practice a lot, and, you know, they're usually not that good, but I usually still have fun, but these friends were really good, and, you know, we were all pretty evenly matched, and, you know, we were playing League Play, we won all five of our placement games, which isn't easy, a lot of times it's pretty hard in my opinion. I've never won all five of my placement games before, and we won all five of them, and then the next game we got put into a game, and everyone, and, and after all five of them we got put into Platinum, and, you know, you can't get put into Masters off your five placement games, because, um, just for some reason you just can't, and... Our first game after getting put into Platinum, after the five placement games, was against a team of full Masters um, who were in the Master League, and if you don't know, that's the best league, and it was a really close game, and we barely won on hard point, and that was really exciting, we were working together, and the next game, you know, it only gets harder and harder every time you win, and the next game, we were up against a team, and right before the game starts, you get to see their stats, like, right, that, that's the point where you can't back out, and we were playing with all higher Master Leagues than the rest of them, you know, like, a higher rank, um, like, lower number, which means better, and I was looking at all the ranks, and I look, and I see that we're in with Master Rank 1, which is pretty cool, because, you know, sometimes I'll see, like, a really low one, I'll see, like, oh, there was, like, 17, 34, I was like, okay, cool, and they said Master Rank 1, I was like, whoa, this is pretty cool, I was like, Master Rank 1, that's, that's sick, and of course we did lose, we lost 6-2 in Search, not our best game type, but it was still pretty fun, and it was just cool, because, you know, we got to play with Master Rank one like n supposedly according to stats best player so who knows maybe we could have gotten into a game with you know like an optic or something like i know optic nade shot plays league play a lot anyways um yeah league play is pretty fun tell me guys tell me like the farthest your team has gotten put into uh, the bracket and yeah tell me if you enjoy this gameplay i wasn't using a camo because i thought you know it'd be f more fun to uh, do it you know just because it was a representation of like you know it was just like a raw gameplay and Actually, it was pretty f funny because this is my second time recording this commentary. That's why I'm going to be uploading it late because I had to go out. But the first time I sneezed and I was like, yeah, I was like, I was like, you know, some people will start a whole commentary over if they sneeze or something. I don't understand that. And I look after the video and the video, for some reason, the audio wasn't recorded. It was just so frustrating and I didn't have any time to record it again. And I went out. So I was like, OK, and I got sushi. Sushi's amazing. But yeah, it was just it was just kind of funny because you know it was karma. I had to, I, now I'm redoing the commentary, but you know I like commentating; it's pretty fun. And um, leave a like on this video if you want to see more challenge videos. I really enjoy doing these because they're really a lot of fun, and you guys leave some really good challenges. So leave a uh, l leave a comment below below saying what challenge you want to see me do next. If you want to see it live or not, you know pistol gameplay, assault rifle, whatever you want. This was a really good idea. Thanks again, Simon. You rock. I hope you guys enjoy this. Leave a comment. I'm AVX and I'm out.